The European Union's food standards are set to slump below Britain's after it lifts a ban on farm feed made of animal remains in the hope of producing cheaper food. As a result of the shift, cheap pig protein could be fed to chickens to ensure European farmers aren't undercut by lower standards outside the bloc. The change is expected to come into force in August despite a last-ditch attempt by MEPs, led by the Greens, to scrap the policy. An original ban on the practice was introduced during the BSE crisis but it will be lifted after plans were endorsed by all EU member states, except France and Ireland. Using animal protein made from mammals in the feed of cattle and sheep was banned by the EU in 1994 at the height of the made cow disease crisis. The first reported case of the nightmare BSE disease was in 1986 in the UK. It was spread widely by farmers feeding cattle with the meat and bone meal of dead and infected animals. More than 4 million cattle were slaughtered in the UK alone and 178 people died after contracting a human variant, known as Creutzfeldt Jakob disease. The EU extended its ban on all pap feed in 2001 to avoid cross contamination. In recent years there has been momentum in calls for a rethink after BSE was given negligible risk status across the bloc. Bruno Moline, of the Copa Cogica Farming Union, described PAP as an important source of phosphorus-rich and highly digestible proteins that many pig and poultry farmers were looking forward to having access to again. The UK will continue to ban the use of such animal feeds because it is committed to maintaining higher animal welfare standards. A spokesman for the Department for Environment, Food and Rural Affairs said, the UK is committed to maintaining the highest animal welfare and biosecurity standards, and following our departure from the EU there is no legal obligation for us to implement any of these changes. Dot dot. As an independent trading nation we have the option to review our own to see legislation in the future and ensure that any changes made would maintain a high level of protection of human and animal health and food safety, on the basis of scientific evidence. Michel Barnier, the EU's former Brexit negotiator, used to attempt to lecture Britain about cutting food standards after leaving the bloc. He secured a level playing field provision in the treaty that allows either side to slap tariffs on exports if standards slip below the others. 